Hello, this is Radio KL and uh, today we are going to demonstrate uh, Sputnik DWG Dual Waveform Generator. Uh, it is a model um, um, which in essence is a clone of uh, Bukla 258, uh, to my opinion one of the most raw sound in uh, analogous latest. Uh, and uh, for instance oscillators such as an, uh, Plan B model 15, it is based on uh, 258 and uh, arguably, arguably it's one of the best sounding oscillators, VCOs, uh, analog oscillators uh, out there and uh, uh, that says a lot, I think. So, okay, door waveform generator is uh, two VCOs and uh, its uh, strong point is uh, cross-modulation uh, capabilities, uh, one oscillator modulating another and uh, that one uh, does modulate uh, well the fast oscillator. And uh, uh, here it is patched as follows. Uh, I have uh, an output of first uh, patch to exponential FM uh, of uh, right oscillator and uh, right oscillator is uh, patched to wave shape uh, of first uh, which morphs between uh, sine and uh, square waveforms uh, so it sounds quite sick, let's hear it sounds like a filter sweep but actually it is uh, an exponential uh, FM as I added um, on a second uh, oscillator and you hear something that resembles uh, filtered noise maybe uh, with wash sound uh, it's uh, very very insane and uh, it's incredible what you could achieve with this uh, VCO alone uh, and uh, also one note uh, what we are hearing uh, uh, Basically, two oscillators uh, go into a mixture if station uh, synthesizer used as a mixture, no effects applied, uh, only raw uh, analog output of uh, the waveform generator. Uh, so, okay, let's uh, get back to our sounds. again one very awesome uh, like uh, filter like uh, uh, sweep uh, but it was uh, actually 
a frequency sweep and I now have uh, uh, with uh, oscillating mo modulating wave shape of this one and uh, once again uh, fast uh, modulates wave shape of an hour which uh, uh, moves uh, between the sine and square so what you are hearing is uh, like a filter uh, with uh, basically uh, um, very high resonance and uh, one more note uh, is that uh, DWG or Bukla 258 uh, has one of the most clear signs possible, maybe not as clear as digitally generated ones, but it's really almost perfect signs, so what you hear is uh, really a nice and clear sound and it's because uh, this oscillator has such good signs. Maybe now let's try something new. I will disconnect a uh, fast oscillator and I will modulate the frequency of another uh, both uh, linearly and uh, exponentially and uh, uh, let's hear what uh, will happen. some cross modulation so this is without cross modulation and uh, once again to how awesome it is we are now having uh, an amplitude modulation like effect uh, so we have no VCA but uh, we are having bursts of sounds I guess uh, that's because, because it comes to a very low frequency what we cannot hear or maybe no maybe uh, well maybe too high of a frequency uh, yeah which only kids <laughs> could hear uh, maybe quite awesome and uh, maybe uh, uh, to end uh, 
our demo. Uh, maybe let's uh, hear uh, an uh, oscillator too without any modulation, uh, uh, just uh, clean wave uh, either sine or square because even at a single, for, exa uh, for example, low frequency, uh, it sounds really bouncy and uh, powerful. Uh, you have such intense bass, uh, it's, uh, it's basically insane. So maybe let's try to hear it. Clockwise, which is saw, we have a bit of a saw, and I'm turning into a sign, and you hear this uh, really awesome effect. Let's hear it. So we could have uh, applied. Uh, some uh, LFO, uh, sign LFO of uh, not uh, mm, so big amplitude to wave shape and instead of, instead of uh, turning the knob we would uh, hear the sound uh, automatically without doing, it, doing anything and uh, I like the sound, it's like uh, It sounds like almost if I applied a delay to it, but I only added some more frequency modulation.
and now we could hear some uh, feedback. Uh, let's play it together. What plays live from the source later and what I have just recorded, and uh, it's gonna be quite uh, interesting. Absolutely stunning module. 